Hello guys, it's James Griffin from Productions today, and today we are taking a look at the YouTube app for the Nintendo 3DS. It just came out today, and it is pretty good so far. It took a while to get logged into James Griffin from Productions because I have two accounts for some dumb reason, because of Google Plus, and uh, yeah, it would not let me select it until had some workarounds, but here this is the YouTube app. I'm going to do a video of, um, go to my subscriptions, and I'll, actually I'll show you one of my videos, because it's my videos. So I click on my, uh, channel here. Come on. It's loading my channel. Okay. Okay, so we got James Griffin on Productions. Focus camera. Thank you. I'm gonna take a I'm gonna I'm gonna do the iFunny scam ad video. Just cause. And it's it plays on the top one. Not on the bottom screen, but the top screen has like info and a preview and all the controllers on the top. It has your um video which is pretty nice it does use your google plus and if you do use two step authentication like me you have to use google authenticator because it is google i have two step authentication of course with the authenticator app on my ipad you go to your subscriptions you can pretty much do anything you can with like on the youtube app for us L or B is back to like go to the previous video, and R or A is the forward. So here's my subscriptions on the bottom screen. Sky is Minecraft, Etika. <laughs> then you can select all activity and more. I don't think you'll be able to upload from a 3DS YouTube app because a 3DS you can. Record videos, but I don't think you can upload. Let's see if you can upload. And it's, it's very sensitive to tapping. I'm just scrolling and it clicks for some dumb reason. But there's no upload capabilities. Just watching videos. At least you can use your own account, which is great. This is my review on the YouTube app for the Nintendo 3DS. Thanks for watching everyone.